Hi guys, Lee just one here and welcome back to some more Game With All Guns. In the last episode, we used the MP11 and got totally crapped on by ASM1s. Now luckily for me, the ASM1 is now the next gun I need to use. And I do know that it is quite good, but for me it's not been amazing. But I did start using it again not that long ago and it did do quite well, so hopefully it can stick to doing well for me. And um, yeah, I'm going to be running with suppressor and foregrip and laser sight just kind of there because I had it. And hopefully the suppressor will actually be quite good for it. And yeah, let's get into the game. Alright guys, so we've got a TDM on comeback here, which might not actually be a very good map for this gun. Because this is a kind of more long range map than others. But hopefully, just hopefully, I can get some kills with it. Like I just got a kill somehow there and I beat a guy with two guns. I beat a dual wielder guy, somehow. Right, okay. So not too bad start. Not too bad. Uh, could definitely have been worse like yesterday. Yesterday's was a horrible start, I'm pretty sure. In fact, no, it wasn't yesterday's, it was an average start. And then it just turned to absolute crap, so... Hopefully it's not the same with this game. Right, there's usually people camping in here. Oh god. Yeah, there was somebody camping in there. There's always somebody in there. Mate. Teammate nearly got me killed there. Blocking my path. You, you did, you did. Oh no. No, there's an actual wee squeaker in this lobby. No. Sorry, babe. Sorry, mate. Oh, Matt. The squeaker got me killed. That's my excuse. We've taken the lead. Squeaker killed me. Right. We need to start getting more kills here. I've only got two. Um. It'd be helpful if I could actually see people though. Not gonna lie, it would be definitely more helpful. This gun does some amount of damage up close. Cause that guy should have probably killed me and I just rinsed him. Oh man. Oh well that's the same guy. He deserves that kill. I suppose. I wish I could stop coming up next to him though. Cause I feel like his gun should be more effective than mine at close range, like Point blank range, more like. Oh, how did this gun not kill him? The ASM1, it's the bloody best gun in the game. Probably. See the amount of assists I'm getting? It's actually dumb. This is like the assist gun. Right, there seems to be enemies over here, so. Having a laugh? There we go. But you see, how many bullets does that guy need? Yeah, I'm so killing this guy up here. Oh yeah, and I get a supply drop. And... I'm trying to kill his teammate, there we go. This is better, getting the UAVs. This is definitely a fun uh, loadout though with the suppressor, I'm not gonna lie. It's with the foregrip it makes the recoil virtually invisible. And then with the, um, the suppressor it keeps you off the map. Whoa, what the hell is that? Random frag, of course. The suppressor just keeps you off the map, so you can just kind of run around freely without really many people knowing where you are. So, so far, I'm recommending this little class. I'm not going to make judgments too quickly, though. Probably play a couple games with this gun. Oh, there we go. Nice little kill again. So, I'm actually enjoying this game. For once in my life, I'm enjoying. An advanced warfare game. Right, I, pff, no way. <laughs> I was never going to kill him, he was jumping around like a fairy. There we go. I'm actually surprised, this isn't, this is actually like a kind of casual lobby. There's not, there's like no sweat fest in this one. Please don't see me. How am I still alive? How am I still alive? What? What? The streak of dream, oh, okay, well. The streak of dreams ended, but I do not know how I was still alive for half of that. It's as if when you put this gun on, it makes you get more, you get more health than the other guys. Actually, this with laser sight and foregrip as well. So obviously, suppressor keeps you off the map. Foregrip makes the recoil like just invisible. Hang on. Oh, and then the uh, laser sight is actually really helpful for those hip fire kills. And I don't usually hip fire that much in this game, to be honest. 
Oh no. I need to have killed him there. Never mind, my teammate got. Is this another frag? Ah, oh, it's a stupid assault drone thing. Don't know why I'm heading towards it. Screw that, I'm going this way. Right. God, the guy with those dual wheel guns. It's quite annoying. Especially when you're just kind of casually running through the map. And then he just pops out of nowhere and does a pure exo boost out the way. Those exo boosts can be some like some good way to um, maneuver. There we go. Finally got him. I was, like shot like ten busts and then <laughs> didn't kill him. So that was actually a really fun game. I don't know if I get many kills, but I didn't have that many deaths really. 18 for 9 is actually pretty solid. I don't know what the best game I've had so far is, but 18 for 9 is actually quite good. I'll definitely take that. And the ASM1, that class by the way, is a really, I recommend that. It is quite a lot of fun to use, especially when it's not a, a pure sweaty lobby. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this episode of Game With All Guns. Be sure to leave a like and a comment. If you really enjoy, subscribe for more in the future. And I'll see you guys later.